What's going on everybody? It's your boy Shabor. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, we've got another video for you guys. We are here in Don Kyoto or Don Q. Japanese people, they call it Donkey, like Donkey store or whatever. Um, this is a really dope store for the most part because this is the mega center, I guess. This is the mega Don, uh, the mega store. You got all of this stuff over here. And you have like a bunch of, um, what is this, eye care? Bunch of like small shops within the store itself as well. If there's like anything close to uh, like a Walmart out here in Japan, this would be it. Like this would be, this is like the closest thing to Walmart here. It's like a Mountain. swap meet to me. Well, if I, if I had to compare it to Walmart, this would be the closest thing to Walmart. Look at this, you got just like the other video we did, bikes everywhere. Look at this. Over here, you got your cats and your dog area, which I think is pretty unique that they sell dogs and cats, animals in general, in pretty much every type of store. Like, the prices are mad expensive too. 183,000 yen. It's probably around $1,500 for that one. This was a little bit cheaper. It looks weird, look at his eyes. What kind of dog is this? I don't know. You have a lot though. You have, that looks like adoption back there. Um, some more options. They do payment plans as well. It looks like they do like 5,600 yen um, per month, probably for three years. Okay. Let's go ahead over here. So I don't think I've ever been in this one. I think my wife has, right? You've been in this one, right, baby? Yeah. I haven't been in this one, I don't think. Like, I just waited in the car while she came in because I really didn't feel like it. So this is gonna be like a new experience for me as well, for the most part. Look at this. I don't know what this is right here. It looks pretty cool. I think this one's bigger. Yeah, I think, I don't know. The other one is not, not that big. It's a mega, it's a mega as well, but it's not that big. Let's see. Oh, we're playing Tetris here in the house. Really trying to figure out how to get through here. Here we go. Here's the entrance. The almighty entrance, I guess. I hope. <laughs> Let's see what we got. Oh yeah, here we go. That's the um, that's the Don Q little penguin guy, whatever that is. The store is like overwhelming the first it time. Is, you it is. It is. It's mad overwhelming for the first time whenever you first come in. And I don't know if, about you, if you guys notice about these Japanese stores, but these stores have their own like theme music. I don't know if you guys can hear it. For the most part, that's the theme music for this store. We're gonna go this way first. Look at all these fireworks. Still, we, I really don't understand why they sell fireworks here for the most part. Um, I never see anyone use any fireworks, which is kind of weird. It's not a big island at all. You got a lot of Adidas stuff here as well, like name brand. They sell name brand clothes here. Um, you got a lot of options from like Adidas to Tommy Hilfiger, the Dickies. You got a lot of stuff here. A bunch of makeup. If you guys into makeup, they have, it's like, it's, it's like a lot of Japanese options though. Like, so whenever you guys come to these stores, don't be looking a lot for American products. I mean, I don't, I don't really if don't know black, much about. If you're black, don't expect to find your shade. Well, there we go. If you're, if you're African American, <laughs> don't expect to find your shade here. Uh, we got a lot of stuff though, a lot of clothes options, socks, tons of socks, box of briefs and all that stuff. Just be sure to um, look at the size because Japanese sizes are a hell of a lot different than American sizes here which is important to know because if you like tall like me you can't buy like a normal large you gotta buy like a, a xl like a double um large or whatever luggage i got luggage here belts jewelry I see a lot of japanese people with these shoes right here It's been a while since I had it in my own, like my Nike slides, man. I'm probably gonna come 29. It's not a bad price for them though, for the most part. Got more super, uh, like fake Supreme slides here and you got your jury owls. 
I need a now, new nose ring. Yeah, if this stuff is all the stuff real, obviously the stuff that's not in a container is probably not. Okay, yeah, like you got, you got like change over here though, for the most part, 49. Got a bunch of gold here, like gold plated for the most part. You got some silver, stainless silver. Bracelets and stuff. Yeah, you got some stuff over here. Shades, glasses over here. Yeah, this store is like any type of Japanese store that you go to. It's probably going to be super overwhelming at first because that's how it was with us. Because we went to like so many stores when we first got here. Um, I'm not sure exactly what these are. These are like cigarette stuff, right? Oh, yeah. You can roll your old cigarettes here. They really big into that stuff here. It's weird, like what you will find here. Cause there's like be like random stuff that you would never like think that will be sold here or they sell it here. Zippo lighters was the last time you seen a Zippo lighter. Tommy jeans, watches. And you have like expensive stuff over here as well. So they sell like, I don't know if the, most of this stuff is new. I think, I think a lot of it is used. used, right? Yeah, because you got, like over here, you got Gucci. You got some Gucci items. You have coats, which is super expensive in Japan for some reason. It's not that expensive in the States. Uh, a lot of Gucci options up here for the most part. That's, that's expensive right there. I don't even know how old that bag is. Diesel options. You got Louis Vuitton in here. Gucci hats here. Coach down at the bottom. You got a bunch of stuff. And they have all this stuff here. I mean, majority of it is used, obviously. I don't think they're like a brand new Gucci retailer here, but. And you have, I'm not sure what type of owl this is. Contact owl? Ladies. You have a whole owl for contact. Do you know Japanese people are really big whenever it comes to their eyes for some reason? And that weird to me. But. Got the fuses here, alcohol. Look at those. You got expensive alcohol bottles over there. House. This stuff right here, white must. We already told y'all about white must. This right here, this is the stuff you need. Right here. That's what you need. Air fresheners. You need to get some more stuff. Some more of those. They have, a, they have a lot more options of white must here than they did in the other one, actually. I don't know if it's just sold out in the other one, but yeah. Electronics, phone screens, you got aisles of them. These are air conditioners, fans. Feels good. Yeah, air conditioners and fans. Got a lot of fans. I don't know why they have so many fan options. Like, I would never get caught dead with a fan with just a fan here. Then we gotta have some AC up in that thing with it. Mirrors here. These are what are these Hollywood mirrors? You have one of these, right? I don't think they're on. I don't think they're on. Oh, vanity. Well, I don't know. Got more owls of them here. Japanese, like everything. I mean, they have a lot of stuff that's similar to us, to our stuff. Japanese irons here, though. I've seen some of those before in the States, so that's that's why I'm not really freaked out about how this looks. I've seen them like with a like, little dock and everything. They still do, they're still real big when it comes to those type of cameras. Got a lot of cosplay mask here. Who they got? They have, um, they used to have a lot of, what do they have over here? Oh, the AT, 
We have an 18 year old section. You guys know what this section is. We will not don't show them that. Don't show them that because <laughs> we, we ain't trying to we ain't trying to blur out all of that stuff. But that's funny though because you see a whole lot of like you see a whole bunch of like old you know Japanese men going in there and stuff. It's, it's funny. Yeah, they have knees too, you know. Mad expensive Dyson vacuum cleaners. Can't believe they cost that much for that. I don't. Like how? How is that possible? Rice cookers over there, I think. Yeah. Oh, this you got. <laughs> They're real big on airsoft here, so pretty much you'll find a bunch of airsoft guns here in these types of stores, like a bunch of BBs here. Uh, mags, face, they have a bunch of stuff. Like I said again, a bunch of stuff. Um, Gunpowder, whatever that means. So they're like really big on it. I don't know, should I should I get some of these? No. Why not? For what? I'll go ear something. Listen, 2,500 likes on this video and I'll go ear something. And these Japanese, let me tell you something, Japanese, People, they don't mess around when it comes to aerosol. Like they like Navy SEALs out here. It's crazy. We got we got tickle me Elmo and everything like that for kids. We got this right here in Japan. I don't I still don't know what it's called. But this is like well-known kids, everything here. Bunch of toys over here. This is my type of owl right here. A white musk fragrance satchel. Satchel? Satchel. Yeah, we should try a new one. Look, they even have white musk bonus sticks, like incense. That you can burn. That's pretty cool. Not sure what type of owl this is over here, but I think it's like a home owl. Like stuff like that, you know? Yeah, Owls for the floors for like children's bedrooms. You can come buy a bunch of those here. Um, bunch of pillows from outside. They got furniture here as well. You can gotta you gotta put it together, obviously, but they have a lot of furniture here. These are like bed sheets because they sleep on the floor here. Probably have some curtains here as well. Pillowcases is how they come. A bunch of colors and pillowcases. Not sure exactly how, well, 43 centimeters by 63. You gotta, you know, convert that into inches and everything. Because Americans, we use inches. Bunch of pillows and stuff. Guess this is the, another cat or pet section. You're, you had a big one out there. I guess you'd have like, you ever seen a cat wear a diaper before? I don't think I've ever seen that. That's pretty cool. Took one in the main aisle. Huh? We're in the back. Oh yeah, we're in the back. We're gonna go to, we're gonna go to the main one. You ever seen Japanese Listerine before? They have a lot of American brands here. It just looks weird. And like majority of it doesn't taste or is it the same as American products? You guys may think, how is that the case? It is the case. Like we got gummy bears, right? What is it called? What brand gummy bears we had the other day? Harmbo? Harbo? Yeah, we had har horrible gummy bears, right? You guys had horrible gummy bears before. Here in Japan, they have them, but it, they use Japanese flavors. Like they don't have blue raspberry. They use like, what is it, liche? Lishi. Lishi, and that shit's Stuff disgusting. Like that. <laughs> it's, it's awful, like I'm sorry, like I don't. Look at that. Ice maker machines there. Cologne, they have a lot of products here. where like, you see like on the TV ads, like late at night. Yeah, they have like a bunch of, you, as you've seen it on TV gadgets and everything. Oh, here's the best owl. Here's the best owl to come to, though. The food owl. They got a bunch of beer. They sell boxes of beer here. Water. Ooh. Does that look good? Does that not? Mm -hmm. I think this is Korean. We got some Korean type drinks over here. Um, I'm not sure if this is alcoholic or not. 
I kind of want to try that out. It'd be weird. Like, how do you recycle this? This is plastic. So probably just plastic? Yeah, probably. But it has an aluminum top, right? It's kind of weird. We should get a basket. Ooh. Actually, you shall receive. We're going to try these. You want to try one? Okay. Just, no, let's get one. I don't care about that. Energy drinks. Aquarius, Bakari Sweat, little packets. I've never seen the packets before. That's pretty cool. All right. Let's come back out this way. They got Red Bulls here as well. Red Bulls. Japanese lighting all over it. The Red Bulls taste the same. That's about the only thing I heard uh, that I know of that tastes the same. The Monsters taste a little bit different. They got a bunch of drinks down there. Coca-Cola, Pepsi. They all taste different here. It's like it's not as carbonated. We got produce here. This is why I probably compare it to Walmart. Like a smaller, small version of Walmart. Cause you got all the knickknacks. It's like a one-stop store, if that makes sense. You can come here for some cologne or you can leave with some chicken wings. You know what I'm saying? We got barbecue steak there. It looks like some barbecue steak, right? I'm not sure what this is right here. That looks good. Bacon, it's bacon. Look at all this meat you got here. Large selection of meat, tater tots. Yeah, well, that's some rotisserie chicken for your eyes. That's teriyaki chicken? It looks weird. Like it looks like you've been sitting there for a while. Bunch of like Japanese plates too. This is the best part about it. Cause if you're hungry, you can just come to any store and get something already cooked, you know? Got uh, squid balls over there. What are these called? They have squid in them. So I know it looks appetizing, but you'll be eating squid. Fuck me up the first time I ate it. I'm not even gonna lie. Fresh watermelon, super cheap too. Compared to going on the base to get produce. Watch your snacks here. Oh. You know, we get a lot of questions like, do they sell a lot of nachos and dip? I want to try that. A lot of questions on, do they sell a lot of American products in these type of stores? Somewhat. They're um, like, they're like not these really. Cookies. <laughs> yeah, I like these cookies. We all saw these before in Kroger or something. Yeah, because they have Japanese writing on them as well, but not all over the can. So you can look all over the can. There's not an ounce of Japanese writing other than the little sticker that they have to use to ship it out here, right? Mm -hmm. Like the the fat sticker. But everything else is in English. So like these like like they have a lot of Look at those Oreos. Yeah, they have a lot of import Mama. stuff out here as well. What? I want purple. Bananas? What is bananas? I'm not you wanna try these? <laughs> Looks sweet. Big ass lollipop. Look at this big ass lollipop. Shut up, boy. Let's go. What else we got over here? Some pull ups for your kids, diapers. Here's the thing right here. Look here. Here's why Japan is on some, Japan is on some weird stuff, right? What the a big ass thing of alcohol. It's five liters of liquor. Only in Don Quixote. Five liters of liquor. You got, they get smaller as they go. You got four liters here, 2.7 liters here. I'm talking about big things of liquor, like they're cheap liquor too. You got, you got American brands here. You got Jack Daniels, you got Maker's Mark. Um, you got a lot of Japanese brands here. Oh, you got that thing on you. you got that thing on you, you know what I'm talking about. Jim Bean. I guess this is a cheap liquor owl over here. You have this stuff right here as well, which I've been meaning to try. Um, they're like little shots, different flavors, like they're all different flavors here. You seen these before? Not in a pack like that, no. I've seen them separately. I'm like, I feel like these will tear you up. Peppermint, they got a bunch of, you want to try these? 
Like, I don't know if they're like, what are they called? Like moonshine shots or what? You have a cheaper one here. I wanna try, I'm gonna try those. Go down a couple more aisles here so you guys can see more alcohol, more liquor here. Beer aisles here, wine. Mama. Okay. Oh, we got down here. We actually need some of this. We need, we need, um, is that downy? I like this Bug sprays. These are all bug sprays and everything right here. Super important out here because there's a lot of bugs here. That looks about it, ladies and gentlemen. Not too much stuff here uh, that we haven't seen. But well, majority of it is like um, very, like I said again, it, you, you'll get super overwhelmed at first. It's even navigating yourself around here because there's so many owls here. But when you get it, you get it. Like when, it, when you get it, you got it. I don't know. What do you check out at? What do you huh? check out at? I don't even. Excuse me. Oh, here we go. Y'all, it's been real. We got a basket full of stuff down here. Let's see what we got. We got some watermelon, first and foremost. You gotta have that watermelon. We got a bunch of snacks. Uh, don't know what this is. Haribo peaches. Hopefully it tastes good. Got some of these though. Strawberry marsh uh, marshmallow candies. So don't know. But we finna go ahead and wrap it up and get on out of here, man. It's been real. We got a bunch of stuff in the cart. There's people behind. People behind us. Oops, sorry. We're going here? Nope, let's go over here. Let's go over here. Ain't nobody over here. Ain't nobody over here. Yeah. But thank you guys so much for clicking on the video. Until next time, it's your boy, and we out. Peace.